We are back for another fuel flow test on the Challenger. Today we'll be flying up the Yellowstone River at 5700 RPM to see if we can lower the fuel burn without giving up too much speed. I'm expecting a beautiful flight up the river and will land in Columbus to check the amount of fuel burned. However, Montana has been experiencing flooding for the last week, so I'm also anxious to see the current state of the river.
so far the river is looking okay to me, but here appears to be a shed in the river. I was so intrigued I had to turn around and take another look at it.
see what's left of a house that fell into the river. This one turned out to be the house of Michael Lindsay. We're near Park City here. And looking at this house and some pictures, we can see that the shed we saw earlier was actually the top part of this house. So naturally I was curious and to see just how far the top of that house floated down the river. It seemed like it went at least six miles before coming to a rest near Laurel.
that whizzed by me in a Cherokee while I was flying up the river here. I got to meet him at the airport. Turns out he's a really nice guy who flew in from Cody to this plane just out of annual and he was having breakfast at the on-site restaurant at the airport.
and here's Columbus. Having not seen anyone or heard anyone on the radio, I couldn't resist doing the straight in here. Once I got on the ground, it turned out that I'd burned roughly three and a half gallons of fuel over the course of about 45 minutes. Thanks for coming along with me on this one. I uh, hope to see you on the next. <laughs>